Nick tell me he's not moving off my driveway? Think I she called someone the N-word without even blinking an eye. I called you that this Lee County woman is proving racism runs deep in Southwest Florida. The hate hurled at two men trying to work. I you, did. you can't no, use I that language. I can use the word all oh, God mother no. harassing us now. It is the new stunning video you're seeing right now at 11. I'm Peter Bush. And I'm Brenna White. It's hard to listen to this disgusting language, but the woman spewing it says it's her right. Tonight, only NBC2's Gage Goulding gets the response from the men she verbally attacked. Yeah, Brenna, Peter, this video, it's absolutely shocking. It happened on Saturday and was a portion. It was all captured on a cell phone. That video posted to social media where hundreds are now speaking out in anger. And if you think I'm going to have a f tell me he's not moving off my driveway. A racist rant all over a truck parked on the road. Will Osley and Melvin Finley own a moving company. On Saturday, they were in Lee County unloading a truck. That's when this woman, Gina Brashear, got mad that the truck was blocking the road. Me and him are on the back of the truck. We're still working. We're still unlo uh, you know, unloading the, the, the sheets of metal onto the pallet. We start hearing this commotion on the other side of the truck, just getting louder and louder and more intense. That's the moment when the customer, who didn't want to speak to me out of fear, starts capturing this video. In 30 seconds, Brashear unloading a racist rant. And if you think I'm going to have a f tell me he's not moving off my driveway, I can use the word f oh god mother f That wasn't it. Good, the cops are coming, tell him I called y'all what the f ever. I didn't call y'all I called that f say that. Now for your trailer. I can't say Please bring it to me in writing. She screamed the N-word right six now. times in just now. half a minute. You know, I've been, you know, insulted before. It's nothing new to me. But this time around, it's a little, I don't know, it just feels a little different. It feels bigger than me. I went to Brashear's home. She didn't want to come out to talk on camera, but she spoke with me on the phone. I and over the course of the video. I say it a hundred times in 30 seconds. There's nothing illegal about saying it. Do you feel that it's okay to use that derogatory Absolutely. word? Absolutely. Do I have reasons to be racist? Absolutely, I do. I asked her about people calling her racist online. One thing you need to get, get straight from coming from me. I don't care who's upset. I don't care that I'm called a racist. To Melvin and Will, this is bigger than just affecting them, and they hope it's the catalyst of change. It's 2021, man. I don't, I don't know. We have a very long way to go. We have not come as far as we claim. We have a, we have a long way to go. Yeah, Will and Melvin wanted to tell this story to open the eyes of every. Hi, this is Aisha. How are you? These people say catalyst of change. They act like they never heard the word nigger before. This bitch said nigger about six times and everyone is pretending like, where did this come from? Who are we? You know exactly who you are. Are you surprised? You shouldn't be. Have a good day. Bye.